What a gorgeous day. Minus 9 Celsius here again today. And I've got a little project. Not sure how well this is going to work out. We've been watching our, the sun. I'm going to shine you right up into the sun. Behind that, um, those ash trees there. But I have my Blue Eddy solar panels. This is the 6th day of January. So this is about the worst solar conditions we're going to get for recharging. This is a 400 watt, I think, system that Blue Eddy had sent me. And I've got it plugged into my panel. Now the battery, I've been using it for a couple of days. It was down to 29%. And as we will see, I was putting in, just plugged it in five minutes ago. And we're still at 29%, but we're, we're inputting. I don't know if you can see how much we're inputting. Hard to focus on that. 179, 100 and, yeah, 170, let's say, watts. These are 400 watt panels that Blue Eddie sent me. And my battery pack is down to 29%. It's January 6th. The sun is a terrible angle, low in the sky for time as it is. 11:40 in the morning so we're going to watch that sun go around the edge of the trees and we're going to actually see if that little bit of sun that we get is going to make any headway in charging this battery up with these solar panels today so let's just set it and forget it and i'll come back after a bit i've got some errands and chores to do i keep everything for this blue eddy in this ammo box all the cables and connectors blue eddy bits i've written right on top of it so that uh, it just stays with the with the generator. I use this generator for everything, and it's uh, it's a their AC two hundred. It's just a great all around little generator. It would be very comparable to a gas powered two thousand watt generator for the output. I can run a pancake, air compressor, chop saw, all at the same time. Charge my Ryobi batteries up. Anyway, let's come back to this in a few hours and see if it actually made any difference. I'll come down and adjust these panels too. Thirteen minutes to four in the afternoon. Don't have a microphone on, so I might have to yell. Let's see how far this blue eddy charged up. In uh, what time? So let's say it's four o'clock. So twelve, one, two, three, four, five hours. We'll see. I bet not very much. The sun doesn't get really much more than what you see it there above this the uh, the horizon this time of year. I'm hoping for forty percent. Forty percent, exactly. That's pretty good. So there's no sun right now, or very little. You can see it's just a haze on the horizon. The panels are still set up, and we have got forty percent and only twenty watts going in. Nineteen, eighteen. I wonder if I tip it up, what happens? Let's just tip the panels up, see if it increases. Twenty-four, twenty-three. Not enough to make a difference. Anyway, I think what we got to do is put this away. I'll plug it in. Anyway, I use these solar panels a fair bit. I use this generator all the time, all the time. So today I just thought it was going to be a fairly clear day. Um, I should have been at it probably around 10 in the morning. I probably would have got up to 50% charge. But that's a realistic expectation from uh, the solar generator on a winter day. This is as... That's about what you can expect. So kind of like free energy though just comes from the sun you don't have to worry about uh, uh putting gas in a generator um i will top it up i'll plug it in the wall and make sure that it's 100 percent for the storm that's coming but anyway that's it blue eddy for the win always thanks over and out i told you that these were 400 watt panels but i lied to you they are 350 watt panels they're made for this atv though Perfectly right here along the side. I would put a strap around that, keep that safe. The generator comes with all the cables you need to connect it to 12 volts, to connect it to 110, to connect it to uh, another solar panel. Ice on it. Still cold here today. I'm happy with that, 40%. What do you think? Do you think that I should have in about five hours charged more than 11%? That, but, you know, in all honesty, with hardly any sun today, 
this was summertime, that was to still be charging probably the full wattage. So there, I plugged it in the wall, and now we're charging at just about 400 watts, so that won't take very long. Nice.